Hey guys, it's Quay and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we're going to be talking about this video that popped up on my recommended page called Why I Stopped Watching Kelly Stamps and it's by this YouTuber named Jenna Brown. Before we get started, definitely subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. It would mean so much to me. I would love to have you a part of this little club that we got going on. But yeah, without further ado, let's, let's talk about it. So, in Jenna Brown's video, she came to this realization that she was jealous and hate watching so she unsubscribed and she really goes into detail about why she you know why and how she became jealous and I thought it was a very moving video because not many people are willing to open up that much and really lay it all out on the line for millions of people to judge them especially when it comes to something like jealousy I was reading through the comments and I noticed that a lot of people well not a lot of people but some people were trying to drag her and bash her for sharing with us and just being really vulnerable and explaining a very real human emotion that all of us feel which is jealousy feeling that we are not good enough you know we're comparing ourselves to others it's something that we all feel and for people to act like it's this foreign idea and like bash her for having these feelings is really disgusting and it's really gross because it's like no one's perfect and everyone has experienced jealousy or has felt less than at some point in life. I want to talk about how I guess it all started for her and I guess just also give words of encouragement. I think when you're forced to see someone constantly shining and vibing, just doing, living their best life as they should, you start to compare yourself to them and you start to feel insignificant. You start to feel less than and you're like, why am I not like her. It's so easy to see others on social media making like $10 million a year and you're sitting around making, you know, 20 and you feel insignificant. You feel less than and you're like, what am I doing wrong? Why am I not on their level? Why am I not them? Am I just destined to be like this? We don't really be knowing how these people get all that money. They might be scamming. <laughs> um, but you know like she talked about you know not being on a date in so long and Kelly went on a date and she just felt less than she just felt basically unattractive which I can relate to I haven't been in a relationship in months years and when you have friends you try to buy friends who are you know dating going on dates doing this and that you do feel like the ugly duckling you just feel like you're there's something wrong with you and there's nothing wrong with you, babe. Like, if you're watching this, which you're probably not, there's nothing wrong with you. You are perfect, you're beautiful, just the way you are. The thing with comparison is, it's the thief of joy. And it's hard to not compare yourself. Trust me, it's like so hard, because we live in a day and age where everything is on social media, it's in front of us. We're constantly comparing ourselves to others, no matter what, no matter how hard we try. So it's, it's tough. And I really do admire her for opening up and for sharing that with everyone. It was, it was a very vulnerable moment for her, and but I respect her so much for sharing that because I a lot of people go through that, and I think to see that, well, not to really see it, but to hear that from a YouTuber so raw is unheard of. Because name a YouTuber who's going to be open about those types of feelings. There aren't any. And it's so refreshing to see someone be so open and be so vulnerable. Now, for some words of encouragement and advice to anyone who is comparing themselves to other people, take it from me, you gotta stop. It's hard, I know, it's fucking impossible. But realize that everyone has their time and everyone has their moment. I was reading one of the comments in one of my videos and someone had commented and said, you don't know what people are going through behind the scenes. Social media were only presented with the highlight reel of everyone's life. Just like with the millionaires and the billionaires of our age, like uh, Jeff Bezos, Elon Musk, whoever, we're only shown their success. We're never really shown the struggle that they went through to get to that point. So never compare yourself because you don't know what they had to go through to get to where they're at now. And then honestly too, half of that stuff on the internet is cap. Don't even feel pressed, mama. You're doing great. Trust me, if you're still alive and you're still kicking and you're still working towards your goals every day, you're doing great. You're doing great. This was just like a late night kind of video that I wanted to just get out. Definitely let me know what you guys think down below if you guys have seen that video or just tips on overcoming feelings like jealousy and comparing yourself to others because you never know someone might be struggling with that and 
your comment might be the one comment that really helps them. But anyways, that was all for today's video. Till next time, stay pretty and remember, your time will come. Trust me. Thank <music> you.